Hi everybody, I'm going to do half of the I Love Fall tag. The reason why I say half is because I don't celebrate Halloween. So the Haunted House Ride in Maze, Halloween movie, Candy on Halloween, what am I going to dress up as on Halloween that's non-existent for me. So uh, my favorite fall lip color is what I'm wearing right now. It is number 175 from Maybelline. It is called bit of berry. It's very creamy. It is a beautiful uh, berry color, but more on the magenta side, not on the red side, which is what I like. Um, I really am loving that, and it stays on a very long time. The nail polish that I'm trying out uh, is the, I just got this two days ago from Sephora. This, it comes in this box. It's Sephora plus Pantone Universe. It's in violet quartz and it's a beautiful burgundy color with gold running through it and there is a swatch on my finger. It's very beautiful, very pigmented. They're on sale right now for $5 online so I'm also going to get Reflective Pond which is a beautiful um, deep blue color, like a turquoise blue. Starbucks drink, I can't afford Starbucks so I would have to say Café Bustelo, <laughs> which is what a lot of Puerto Rican uh, or Spanish people drink and what I do to make my coffee it tastes just like Dunkin Donuts coffee is you boil your milk before you add it to your black coffee and it tastes just like a cappuccino or a latte so and of course you add some sugar in there so that's what I drink um, the candles I'm not much on uh, candles because they wear down so quickly so what I do is I use these better homes and gardens from Walmart and I put them in a little tart burner that you plug into the wall this is in fresh lilac and it's absolutely amazing my husband loves this he said that it smells just like home so this is what I use and I use two cubes and it lasts at least a week for me until it starts getting that stale smell so and these are like I think it's $5.94 you get six of them and it's a lot safer too so that's what I use scarves or accessories even though I like the fall cool weather I'm hot-blooded I do not like to wear too much clothing I don't like to layer I don't like any of that I prefer tank tops and sweatpants all the time um, and when I go out in the cold I just wear a coat I don't accessorize with anything really kind of boring even hot I don't like anything touching my head I even in the freezing cold I don't even cover my ears so um, maybe a nice vest with some fur around the neck if I'm gonna go walking but that's about it and like I said the the um, Halloween things I'm gonna totally go over favorite fall thing would be definitely the cooler weather the changing of the leaves because of the colors and um, also a craving for caramel and apples it could be mixed it could be separate whatever so also um, what other haul that I have I bought these I'm trying to limit the purchases that I'm making um, looking at um, Pink So Foxy's videos really helped me to reflect that you know there's not much that we need and we just keep buying 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 so what I did was I took some things back to the store that I wasn't going to use uh, with my receipt and I was able to get two of the new Maybelline what are these called Maybelline they're just lip glosses the ultra shiny ones that just came out and the one that I got is iced chocolate and electric yeah I'm turning 40 these eyes are shot even after LASIK and then I electric shock this is a nice bubblegum pink and here are the swatches so this is the iced chocolate and it's really nice it's the same color of my lips with a nice shine very pretty usually nudes turn pink on me and this day is a nice caramel brown and then this one's awesome I did get the raspberry one and I wasn't crazy about it. So this one's like really pops on your lip. So Target has them for $5.94. Like I said, this one was on credit for me and this one I got with a $4 off coupon at Rite Aid. So not that bad. So anyways, um, another thing I wanted to 
talk about what these symptoms that I'm having, like lupus and fibromyalgia runs in my family, but every single day I'm exhausted, like right out of the bed, like my shoulders are killing me, my neck, and I just feel like beat up all the time, like I have the flu or something. So, of course, I've been to the rheumatologist and they say that I don't have any of the but how 18 points of pain that you're supposed to have but definitely do feel like I need a massage every day and I don't feel like doing anything I don't feel like going out anywhere I just feel like being in bed and hanging out all the time and it's just very unlike me so if anybody has any um any ideas any supplements that they take to just give themselves a little bit of energy um anything like that that would be very helpful I'm just like I said just feeling lethargic all the time and just oh like just rolling my neck all the time and things just crack all over the place so anyways I'm trying to limit my carb intake because I noticed that the carbs do make me feel a lot more tired and bloated and um, getting the sugars and things lowered I'm not gonna say completely out of my diet because that's just unrealistic um, and also I know I need to start exercising. I really don't do that because I'm tired and because I'm achy. It just all goes into one ball. But, um, it does bring me down, you know. I just feel like crying all the time because I'm not used to being this way. And, you know, even, I mean, I'll go to the mall because that's like the only thing. Being around makeup and things like that, that brings me joy. But I do get exhausted even from that, so... But anyways, enough of that. If anybody has any pointers, uh, let me know. Thank you and have a great day. Bye.